Can you say hi to the internet people, Rosie? What's that? Oop. Oop. The viewers are going to love it. Oh! You are too freaking cute. Hello, internet. Today is a good day in the world of Mr. D and Mr. D Likes Rap. For those familiar with my channel, some of my most uh, popular videos have been me ranting about uh, garbage hip hop artists and their treatment of women. And for example, I could do a video today about R. Kelly. I hinted at who he was in my Chris Brown rant a couple weeks ago. But what more needs to be said, besides the fact that the scumbag is now in jail, he's been charged with multiple counts of sexual assault, and he can't afford his bail because he's ran out of money. Nice. And that is some long-awaited news in the hip-hop community. Truly, people were jumping for joy when R. Kelly was put behind bars. All it took was a six-part documentary series on Lifetime to get the job done. Who, who would have known? So it appears that R. Kelly was released from jail after I recorded this video. And then he gave a very intense and emotional and tear-filled interview um, for I think it was CBS and I don't think many people are buying his his feelings and emotions he's his long history of abuse I think trumps him crying on camera and uh, I also just found out that an hour or so after that interview aired he was sent back to jail because he owes $161,000 in child support which he didn't pay. So I'm just going to hope that less things come out in the news between now and when I release this video. Because this guy, he's, he's, uh, he's just, uh, he's all over the place. He is all over the place. But that's not why I'm here today. I'm not here to talk about that asshole. Today is our first ever positive edition of Mr. D Rants. So today I'm talking about 21 Savage. But before I talk about the main, the main scoop, the main idea, I gotta talk about the month that 21 Savage has had recently. He's been through hell of a debacle. He was arrested by ICE at gunpoint, held in a detention center, threatened with phony charges, given support from Jay-Z and Jay-Z's company Rock Nation, given a slew of fantastic lawyers who helped get him out of this problem, and his eventual release. What a crazy month that was. But I gotta say, 21 Savage has been through a lot and he is one of the rising stars of hip hop right now. And it's not just because of his spitfire lyrics and very sometimes creepy whispery flow. It's because for the third year in a row, 21 Savage has launched his bank account campaign to help support teenagers with lessons about financial literacy. Last year, he partnered with an organization called Get Schooled to help spread that message even farther. Now this year, they've begun collaborating with a group called Juma, and Juma is this amazing group that assists at-risk and low-income youth with career advice, housing support. For this video, I wanna take a quick look at the platform that um, 21 Savage has kind of teamed up with in Get Schooled. Let's take a look. So Get Schooled offers this very easy to use interface uh, how to do a resume, how to prepare for an interview. As you can see, 21 Savage's bank account campaign right there, ready to go for 2019. I've already loaded it up here. And yeah, so we got 21 Savage putting out financial literacy tips, everything from learning about paychecks, um, making sure that you keep your credit intact. Um, the big one here, right here, number 10, avoiding bad business. If you borrow, pay it back. This is a huge one because in the US, they're giving out these very shady loans and it's it's really screwing over a large number of people. So 21 Savage is uh, definitely putting out some solid advice, handling debt, dealing with savings. And of course, we got 21 tips from 21 Savage. That is pretty cool gotta say who as as an educator and a hip-hop fan it warms my ever-loving heart to see what 21 Savage is doing he is providing guidance and support to a population that really needs it shows that this kind of charity work can come from all corners of life and it's amazing to see this kind of charitable work coming from one of my favorite rap stars right now you go 21 Savage you should be proud and honored because you've finally shaken up Mr. D rants a little bit you gave me something uplifting as hell to talk about. I've included a link to get schooled in the description because 
I was looking at this thing and it is pretty freaking cool. I also included the billboard article that I found in relation to this campaign. You know, I say a lot that Mr. D likes rap. Mr. D also likes helping. Let's keep up this positivity internet. Mr. D out.